joined as well on this Tuesday morning by Greg Buck in Waukesha, Brittany Merlot in the Wausau area, tracking a very busy overnight hours, early morning hours of thunderstorm activities rolling through the area that uh, will jump into in just a moment just long enough to to say first off uh, to tony thank you very much for the welcome back throwing his whole day off uh, not having me on yesterday well that makes one of you out there so thank you for that and from rob good morning from tigerton cloudy and 66 the storms hit tigerton at 2 15 a.m 70 mile an hour wind gusts quarter size hail inch and a quarter of rain power outages in the wittenberg burnham wood and bowler areas of Western Shawano County and Eastern Marathon County. Again, Brittany was on the money with the storms. Woo-hoo. So there you got that, you got that going for you. Which is nice. uh, I was surprised, you know, a lot of these systems keep going south from our forecast, but not this one. Mm-hmm. This definitely did strike the Wausau area, moved over towards the Fox Valley. There was a tornado warning in Shawano in the overnight hours. But of course, I'm not seeing any damage reports, thankfully. I mean, that is statewide. I am shocked that nothing too bad happened. But some small hail was reported. Of course, there is a flood warning right now into Northern Price, I think Ashland, Sawyer, and also Washburn counties, as you guys got about three inches of rainfall. So a lot of those rivers are still rising. For example, the Yellow River That one is going to be hitting some major flood within the next 24 hours. Also, the Mississippi at La Crosse over the next two days is looking to rise. That could be hitting some moderate flood stages by late tomorrow. And we're also looking at the Red Wing River. I don't know if you heard earlier yesterday in Minnesota, a dam failed. The river just started rushing through some scary stuff after all of this rain. It is ridiculous looking. I mean, this this dam in, in Blue Earth, Minnesota has the water just basically going all around it so that it i mean it it has failed but it, it's still there but it's not doing you any good really no nope. and you're just looking at this going yeah no bueno that's uh dams are <laughs> that's not really how it's supposed to work could you imagine <laughs> being in the downflow no <laughs> what's that greg we're not going to make a damn joke at all here no pun no nothing, no no play on words no no this is this is this is weird this is the kind of weird thing you don't want to see happen on that or or any other dam for that matter. So where do we go? Where do we go from here? Weather-wise? All right. So we've got a high pressure system now taking over. That cold front has moved out of the state. The last lingering showers are down there into like Kenosha Racine area. That's kicking out of here. We'll have a beautiful day. Highs today will be hot, though. We are going to be hitting near 90 the further south you live, mid 80s up further north in the state. And we do have some chances of some spotty showers and storms again later tonight through the overnight into early tomorrow morning, but mainly south of Highway 29. That's the southern half of the state thing, and none of those look strong to severe. So just a little bit of extra rain, nothing like we saw last night. One to three inches. Ugh. Yeah, it was it was especially noteworthy. But um, we have to we have to have that because today is basically the first day of spring. As you know, Brittany, being a meteorologist, that last night with Game 7 of the, the Stanley Cup Finals being done right? and Florida beating Edmonton 2-1, to one, the hockey season's over, the, the Celtics you know, won the NBA title a little over a week ago, so the winter sports are done, so first day of spring, right? Yeah, like yeah. That? yeah, yeah, I think so. You got me there. <laughs> yeah, yeah. As we uh, as we head into nineties and a couple of days into summer, maybe the point I'm making is these seasons run too damn long now. They do. There's the damn joke. <laughs> there it is, Greg. Thank you, Brittany, thank you. We You're got welcome. it. We got it for you. Thanks, Brittany. Have a great day. You too. Good to see you today.